Hi everyone, uh, welcome to uh, the first ever free view of Sprout. Uh, this is a cute little game for free on Steam. Uh, and we're just gonna dive right in, I yeah, guess. let's go for it. Mm-hmm, <laughs> coconut. The little artwork is so uh -huh. cute. Aww. Hmm? Coconut. Acorn. <laughs> Acorn. Acorn that away. Ooh, we have to go pretty far. This is adorable. Uh. <laughs> the bouncy. Sounds Acorn. So Acorn. What a cute... I don't even know what we're doing here, but this is so cute already. We need to find our way through this yeah, entire just, world. Presumably, wow. we just meet the different trees and... It's a long and way. see where our, our oh. family is. I just realized... I thought it was giving us another preview. No, that was the mouse that was moving it all along the world. Oh, that's so funny. So I'm going to travel back to our starting point. I love this. Yeah, it's super this cute. This is such a unique art set. At least for me, I admittedly am not a game expert or anything, but I've never seen anything like this. I really like this kind of simplified... <gasps> he grows into... Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. This is so cute. He's going to be this little dandelion. Dandelion? It's a dandelion, maybe? Aww. Dandelion. Coconut dandelion. Oh, that's the direction you're going in, probably. Maybe yeah. you'll blow away. So click the dandelion. Oh my gosh. It's what? even better than I imagined. Oh, okay. So that's your direction that you go back. So maybe if you want to meet this tree, you'd have to click the coconut. I think so. We grow into a coconut and then drop <gasps> a coconut. This is so clever. It's so cute. It's so logical, though. It's so easy to figure out what we're doing. Maybe what that's like doing. a persimmon. You would you would mention something yeah, like that so earlier. Maybe dandelion to blow away. But click on the persimmon. We'll just see what happens. Yeah. I want to see what happens. Boop. Okay. okay. So that's just not what you want. So yeah, dandelion. <gasps> this is so clever. Oh, you know what I bet's gonna happen? See that little sheep right there? He'll eat the persimmon? I think so. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> this is so cute! Alright. Oh, he ate it. Oh, he's so now I up there. He stayed up there now. Well, do you think if you do the dandelion, it'll keep blowing you to the right? Maybe. Oh, my goodness. And the goodness. farmer calls it home. <laughs> I love this. I love this little village. This right here would be a, my dream game, whatever this little community is. So I guess we s just want to keep... So if you need to go left, you click the coconut? I, I don't think that's exactly... Like, you just have to figure out what well, to do. Try clicking the... Okay. I kind of want to click the coconut just to see what happens. Maybe it's more to do with the weight. So we want to roll down this hill? Let's try being Let's a see. coconut. <gasps> All right. So this is very interesting. So the persimmons get carried, the coconut rolls, and the dandelion blows. Let's see if they do anything Let's see. with this. I don't know. I'm... Oh, this is so cute. And I love that you're meant to figure it. You're just meant to make mistakes, essentially. Oh. Oh, and he's my planting them because he's a <gasps> farmer. This is so cute. Well, I think I there was all that water. I think I need to do that. So I'm I'm gonna try to blow back there and then drop coconuts on the dam until it breaks. Oh, that's so clever! Yeah. And and then maybe okay. that water will let me do I something. I think you're. I think you must be right. If it's if it's driving you here. Yeah. Oh, you're so clever. I love this. This is so the, fun. The art is so cute. 
There, there was a, a game or a book when I was little called The King of Things and the Cranberry Clown. And it w had this kind of style, like this sort of drawn. Like, look at this. It's all like paper cut out. There you go. This is so, I love how intuitive this is. I love how clever this is. Let's down the river. Ooh. Whoa. We're really moving along here. Well, I guess. We'll just pick one and see yeah, what happens. Yeah, let's see what happens when we grow the persimmons. Oh, little birdie's eating us all up. Oh, and then, poot. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Um, I guess maybe I'll try getting blown over there. I love the sound effects. Uh, I don't know. There's like mm -hmm. a vine there, but there's also a coconut. So I'm wondering see, if I'll maybe roll. I'll roll down. Yeah. Let's see. Looks like it. Oh, not quite. Maybe from. Maybe I'll use the persimmons from there. Mm -hmm. Or even just keep blown over. I'm wondering if the dandelion will just blow you back. Let's see. Because it did that earlier. Huh? Not. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's another bird! So, yeah, and it leaned, it looked like. Maybe that was just you, but. The big bird, the big fat bird is getting all of... Hmm. Let's see what happens when we put a coconut. Maybe... There we go. Cute little puzzle game. Oh. And it's so intuitive, it just teaches you kind of what it needs you to do. Peapod. Cute. Definitely do the peapod and we'll see if we can climb up here. <laughs> this is so cute. This is such a neat little puzzle game. Huh. Maybe if I put it lower down, then the bird will be able to get to it. There right. we go. Oh, oh no. he keeps getting <laughs> chased away. So, huh. Well, maybe. Let's see what happens if I put a pea pot. Maybe I'll stretch up and. <laughs> ah! <laughs> You're so clever. Fling. All right. That's cute. And then, so we want to be a coconut, right? So we fall down the thing. This is so fun, and it's so much more than I was expecting it to be. I thought it was going to be maybe too simple, but it's no, not. It's... Like, this is actually a little bit challenging. Yeah, there's, like, the mechanics all make sense, and they give you something new to do each time. Okay, so now... You want to try the persimmon again? Yeah, I think now that I've flung that other bird, that was so... I was just that trying was out so the pea because I got it. Yeah. All right, there we go. Um, and hmm. I feel like We're coconut. On a hill, yeah. So I, I'm a, gonna agree with you. Me. <laughs> okay. So. Okay. Um. From here, maybe dandelion. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, we're we're getting close. Oh, no, no wind. Hmm. Maybe if I climb back up there with the pea pod. And then, then maybe dandelion will give me the wind that I need to. Oh, what blew me back up there? That's okay, because that tells us that we we shouldn't have done that order. So, so coconut. Didn't we try that first? Oh, we did, and then we kind of got. Yeah, we just kind of got stuck here. So, I say climb back up, and then maybe try the persimmon again. Oh yeah, since it's like right because there on the, bird the ledge. Might pick it up and carry it, I think. All right, nope. Looks like he's just going back. Huh? Maybe pea pod right here. Oh. <laughs> no luck. Hmm. What did we try? Maybe try dandelion from there. Do we, we probably already tried that. I think we did, and it just flooped around. Oh, no! That's okay, because we can just use the persimmon and go right back. Huh. You know, despite all the the animation, like, the coloring itself is very simplistic. It's so cute, and the animation is just so adorable. Hmm. 
Are we missing something? So, well, we haven't really been paying attention. So we tried. This is our final destination. So this must be the final difficult challenge. So we haven't done this right here. Oh, I thought we would go ahead. I thought we had the last time, but we did it up there. Oh, I see. Yeah. Hmm. I'm going to take a look back and yeah, see if there's Yeah, maybe we needed to do something in the desert cuz there was an image in the preview of this. So maybe we've missed a step. Maybe because that cactus is technically a tree, right? So maybe yeah. there's something we haven't activated in the cactus. I say go back to the desert. Okay, maybe That's going to be my suggestion cuz maybe there's something in the desert specifically that we missed. All right, then let's see. We'll climb up And then we will use persimmons for, so the bird eats us. Cute little <laughs> pigeon. He's got a blue head like the pigeons that we've encountered here in Hawaii. Oh, the octopoop. We just got a little achievement. I think because we got eaten by birds I thought eight we'd times. Turn those off. Well, but that's achievements. Oh, and okay. clearly I gotta I gotta change a different setting Maybe. for that. Yeah, my guess would just be to keep flying. Hopefully it'll fly us. No! <laughs> oh, we just stay in the same spot. Okay, so... Oh, I think if we do the coconut... It'll roll it, us down to the pea pod, though, won't it? It... Maybe? No, it rolls us Oh, good. Okay. Back. So then... Maybe the... Pers persimmons from here? Hmm. Maybe the dandelion one more time? Yeah, so that we can get back out of the desert. No? Oh, this is so huh. challenging all of a sudden. <laughs> what do we do? Yes, we know that there's a thing there. There's the river. I think I really do think we need the cactus to cross the river, but now we have to figure out how to go back, which presumably is part of the fun, but it's, it's challenging us. So roll over here. What did you use the last time? Was it the dandelion? Try I, the, the coconut, I guess, will roll down. I think so. Maybe the... I used the, the pea pot already. Oh. And that just pulled the, yeah. the limb. Maybe, you know, if the I use the coconut... will it drop? It, it will probably... It'll take us right down Shoot. here. And maybe there's something else we can do once we're down here. Hmm. Like, maybe the dandelion? That seems to be the least doesn't really do a whole lot. So, nope. not the dandelion, for sure. No dandelion. Try the coconut again, then. Yeah, maybe it'll take us on the river. Back or something. So, not the coconut. And... The persimmon? We know what the bean will do. Hmm. Huh. Well, I, I guess it looks like that's... Well, let's take the bean up and... We'll have to figure that out. This is real tricky, actually. I wonder, I bet the coconut just drops me down, but I want to see just for my own sake. Oh no! Okay. Just gotta test out all the options, yeah, and eventually and is, we'll find this it. This is part of the appeal, is that you need to actually learn. So we did the coconut, we'll do the persimmon. I think I had already done the dandelion, and it just loop de loop. That one's gonna get fat now that I've flung the other one away. Now, have we done a dandelion from the hill? I'm pretty sure we have. I think so, and it might blow us back. Oh, well, that's good. Okay, so from here... And that leaves us in the same place. Hmm. I'm pretty sure we needed to do something in the desert. Yeah, I'm I'm suspicious so that now that's I'm the just case not, too. It's just become a challenge of this one level of trying to figure out what how to get back. Well, real quick, I'm going to try growing another coconut over here. Okay. Because I don't think I did that. So I'm going to grow the coconut. Oh, it just takes it down here. Well, that's what I meant, like to do it down here once I've already dropped. Just just in case. Okay. Yeah, maybe it'll roll and stuff. <gasps> there we go. Oh. It doesn't oh. work. I think that was well, the first it, thing we did, actually. Well, no, it moved the log up. That's true. So I, I think maybe this time we're going to launch ourselves. Oh, that could be, yeah. 
The cute little sun. Oh, and the parallax, like the mountains in the background. Yeah, and then we can grow the coconut at the top, and it'll launch us over. Okay. We can do it, I believe. We yeah! did it, Connor! Oh, we landed. And now we're home with our family. Oh. We're now acorns. And we will grow into the mighty oak. <gasps> Yay! Wow, what that a was cute so game. Oh. <laughs> What a sweet game! That, I love that. That was so. Oh, and there's the big bird coming back, all water under the bridge. <laughs> well, that was so pleasant. I. I guess I expected it to be so much simpler than yeah, it actually was. Yeah, I thought was. it would be easier, but that was actually relatively challenging, and I'm not actually sure I would have... I think that would have taken me a lot more time had I done it. Let's look at the credits. Jeff News, game design, art, animation, and programming, and Tim Handley doing animation and programming. Well, great job, Jeff and Tim. Yeah. We enjoyed that, and I actually will will probably play this on my own just because I like the artwork. I think and there's a really lot of sweet. details to see. Yeah. And I would love to see an expanded version of this. Even with the same art style, I don't to think do they need like To do like other levels, other plants, that would be very cute. Yeah, I think this is a really clever idea. I really enjoyed that. Yeah. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you uh, check this out on Steam. It's free, so you may as well um, give the creators a little boost and download it and see how you like it. Thanks for watching. Bye.